Hello YouTube, how are you? It's Banded Wendy on Monday, the 22nd of February 2010. And it is week 48 for me on this lap band post-op journey. And uh, <sighs> recovering from the Las Vegas meet and greet. I'm going to have to do a separate video on that with pictures and video. Um, last week I was 173, I believe, and today I'm 174. So it's a one pound gain, but I will say I gained five pounds uh, on the Las Vegas trip. And uh, this is when I've become very thankful for the lap band. I did not drink a single ounce of water yesterday. None on Sunday. And uh, I drank water, 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 water all day today. Um, and I haven't had the best day of eating either. Uh, but I did run 5K on the treadmill this evening. And I'm happy to report from this morning until this evening I'm down 4 pounds. So 174. One pound gain. Uh, but I'm okay with it. I knew going in to the meet and greet that it'd be a five pound gain was a uh, give or take. And uh, I love my lap band, you know? Um, so that's good. And I hope that gives some of you newbies some hope out there that uh, you can lose five pounds in four days and lose four pounds in a day if you really want to. <sighs> so that's cool. Um, and I'm running 18 miles this week. Uh, and uh, really strict diet this week as well. So, all's good on that front. Uh, what else do I want to talk about? Vegas, totally awesome. Um, great people. Wonderful to meet all of you face to face. Um, so many of you that I didn't even know, actually, that I'm looking forward to learning more about your journeys. Um, and I'm already thinking about uh, the second annual meet and greet in 2011. So well done, uh, Sarah and your pal. I think Andrea, well done. Um, you all need to be there. Don't miss it next year. What else do I want to talk about? Mm. Something that uh, happened to me on Friday in Las Vegas, and I've come to realize that it's happened probably three to five times in the, probably three times, three to four times in the last three months. That is overeating. Mm. Each time it's happened, I've been at a restaurant. Mm. Uh, and when that happens, uh, no matter how good you chew the food, there's no PB, but you can still fill up your new stoma. Uh, and um, I want to start a conversation about overeating after surgery, because it is bad, very bad. I've used this before, right? This is what my doctor says we need to eat, no more than this. And when we eat more than that, we have the possibility of stretching our new stoma. Um, not good. Lots of things bad about that. So this is me talking to myself, Wendy. Um, but it's also um, asking the question, have you found yourself overeating? What does that feel like to you? Are you aware of it? How do you plan to change it? When does it happen to you? Um, for me, it becomes a, a dull pain on my side, and it almost feels like you want to rub it out, um, but you can't, um, and you're definitely not hungry. Uh, it's not the same full feeling that you had pre-surgery. It's a, it's a post-surgery feeling. Um, and for me, I can stay full for eight hours. Eight hours. So that tells you how much food I put into my stomach. So that's a problem. Um, and I do not want it to be a continual problem because I don't want to damage my new stoma uh, and any other organs that I may have in there that could be affected by it. Um, and I paid too much money for the lap band to do that and my whole reason was portion control. So does that mean I need to take my one cup containers in my purse uh, and fill them up because I visually can't stop myself when I'm at a restaurant? I don't know. Working on it, working on it, documenting it, talking about it, opening it up for conversation. We do not want to do it. Um, so, hmm. what else? Um, 
I guess that's it. I'm so tired. Um, BB and Lauren and Melanie. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. And uh, you'll see more of me this week. Lauren and I are running a 5K together on Saturday. It'll be my second one of 2010. And I'm going to run it right next to her step by step. So there'll be more to come. And I'll do um, the information, not the information, but the video uh, of all my stuff together from the meet and greet in Vegas. So hope you're all having a great week. Uh, let's see what happens over the next seven days. I'll talk to you later. Take care. Bye.